Welcome back to another My League video here on NBA 2K17. And in today's video, we are going to be seeing what if Lonzo Ball was a star in the NBA right away. So we're not simulated into the future at all. We're in the start of the 2017 season. Obviously, I have to be there so I can get his whole draft class in there. He's the only player that is completely overpowered. I updated all of his stuff, so he's currently a 95 overall. I didn't want to make him a 99 overall. I didn't want to make him like better than LeBron, better than Russ and Steph. Uh, but he's the 95 overall, so he's definitely a beast right now. He's only 19 years old. I added literally everything. Pretty much everything's like a 95. Uh, so he might be a little bit overpowered. That's what the My League scenario is. Uh, I didn't make many changes to this team. Uh, I actually don't think I made any changes, really. I don't really see anything I did to change the team. Uh, really, all I did was just draft Lonzo Ball. So the team is pretty much the same. Actually, I signed Zaza Pachulia. Sorry if it's really going to make it that much unrealistic. But this is going to be the rotation... Right now, I'm actually going to get Lonzo Ball just a few more minutes. I'm going to give him, like, 35. So, that makes him, hopefully, can lead us to the playoffs. Hopefully. We're going to be doing two years of this. So, the first year is just going to be the way it is. Second year is going to be sort of a rebuild. And I'll see you guys at the end of season number one. And here at the end of season number one, Kevin Durant signed back with the Warriors. Apparently, I didn't even try to sign him. Not going to lie. Maybe I could have gotten him. But this is I'm trying to keep this video a little, at least a little bit realistic just for the first year, though. Uh, so he wins the MVP, of course. Lonzo Ball. Okay, really? That's it for the stats? Really? I thought he'd be putting up like 25 points. All right, you know what? He's the 96 overall. He's 14 points, 7 rebounds, 5 and a, I mean, it's not. Don't get me wrong. Those are not bad numbers. I just thought he'd be a little bit higher. Uh, Enos Kanter wins sixth man of the year. Alde Drummond, defensive player of the year. Kyle Anderson, most improved. Steve Kerr, coach of the Warriors as they go 66 and 16, obviously first in the West. We were second in the West, though. We went 56 and 26, which is not bad at all. Uh, if we want to check out our stats, D'Angelo Russell let us in scoring, then Jordan Clarkson, and then Lonzo Ball. Wow. All right, maybe I have to. Oh, actually, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to, in the rotation, what I'm going to do right here. Uh, where am I going? I'm going to coaching. I got to go over to first scoring option, Lonzo Ball. That's, that's what I need. probably should have done. Uh, but it sucks I didn't do that at the beginning of the season. But whatever, we have one more year. Uh, the Timberwolves third. Drafted Ivan Rab. Interesting. Uh, so, taking on the Rockets in the first round. Harden against Lonzo Ball. Interesting. And we win in six. Now taking on the Clippers. Battle of the Staples Center. We are down 2-0 to 1. Nope, no. Nope. I don't even know if Chris Paul is still with him. I'm guessing they are. He is. And we win in six again. And hold up, the Grizzlies then, they beat the Warriors, and then they beat the Nuggets. The fuck? And then it's a 6-8 matchup over here in the East. That is weird, but no, we're going we're gonna to beat the Grizzlies. We're, gonna, we're just, we're just going to, okay, no, come on. No. Who is on this Grizzlies team? Who is on this Grizzlies team? Like, seriously. What? What? I just don't get things sometimes. Uh, we'll simulate it with SimCast. Uh, we are home, and it looks like we're just absolutely blowing them out. Finally, all right, the six-seeded Wizards, did they sign anybody else? Hopefully they did not. That would be good. Uh, nope, they re-signed Bogdanovich, and they re-signed Otto Porter. Actually, no, Otto, Otto Porter looks like he's either on a rest... I don't even know, because I thought his contract was up, but I guess it's not. Uh, we win game one, we lose game two, win game three, win game four... Come on. No, we're not blowing a 3-0 lead. All right. You know what? We won a championship. All right. There we go. See, we won a championship in our first year. I'm going to go on to one more year. Uh, Lonzo Ball averaged 25 points per game, six rebounds, four and a half assists. That's what I was expecting him to average. So, clearly, he's overpowered. Of course. Like, that's the point. Uh, I'm going to reject all of these. Uh, we are going to skip all the way to the NBA draft. I don't think... And I'm actually not going to make many moves. I think I'm just going to trade these two picks right now for first round. Okay, fine. Take that. Uh, I don't really want to do anything with this team that's too unrealistic. So I'm going to simulate up the team player options. I'm just going to accept all this. We're going to go through the offseason right here. Uh, these guys can all come back. Uh, Tyler Ennis, no. Nick Young accepts his player option. That's fine. I don't even think we're going to have any money anyways. Uh, qualifying, none. I may look. Uh, look, excuse me. Um, who do I want to move? I think, think Luol Deng and Mozgov are going to get traded right now. Maybe for, I don't even know. Cause I don't want to make make this unrealistic. Cause I don't want to go out and like sign like Kevin Durant right now or something. I don't know. It's weird. Um, my free agents, Zaza Pachulia, Tarek Black can have the minimum. So we have like $20 million. So maybe I can sign like a bench piece actually. So I don't think I'm, a, mm, I don't know. Like 
I don't think they'd be trying to trade Timmy Fimazu out in real life. And why is this the... F hmm. All right. Uh, $20 million could probably get... I don't want, really want Dion Waiters for that much money. I don't really need a, another guard anyways. Uh, yep. Gotta have him. Gotta have him. This is a guaranteed championship next year instead of just a possible repeat. JaVale McGee is going to be coming back to the team. Uh, JaVale is going to be play replacing Zaza. They are teammates in real life. Both absolute monsters. Come on. Let's go, Tragic. Come on. And boom. Welcome to the team, JaVale McGee. Uh, Ennis can come back, and so can Tarek Black. Hopefully both both of them are willing to come back, and that's probably going to be it. I just want to see. I don't want to give Lonzo Ball many players that he probably wouldn't have in real life because... I mean, I know Paul George might be coming to him if he if this is all if he does get drafted by the Lakers. They're clearly one of the favorites to draft him. Uh, I think he wants to play for them. They definitely want him to play for them. Uh, so I don't know, but that's going to be it for all of this. I'm going to go to training camps. I'm going to send like D'Angelo Russell and Jordan Clarkson to training camp, and then that is going to be it for this season. Let's simulate all the way up to training camp. Hopefully, this will ever load. I'm just going to auto generate the rookies. It doesn't matter. Uh, so untapped potential, Jesus, D'Angelo Russell's up to an 89. Oh my god, I'll send him there again. Wow, okay. Uh, Julius Randle can go there, and so, nope, nope. And, mm, I'm gonna actually send Brendan Ingram there. So, cool. That works. Uh, the rotation currently ha does have JaVale McGee starting. Uh, he's not gonna start over Zubak. You can have 17. We won a championship with Zubok starting last year, so I actually don't mind that. Lonzo Ball is going to get a few more minutes. I can't believe D'Angelo Russell's already in 89. Kind of ridiculous. Larry Nance can get 22. I'm actually going to give JaVale like 15, 14. Uh, we have a lot of centers coming off the bench, but Lonzo's going to get 35. You can get 35, and you can get 28. So just want to make sure this is set to Lonzo Ball, and I'll see you guys at the end of season number two, where hopefully we can repeat as champions. And here at the end of season number two, LeBron James wins the MVP award with 26.5 points per game, nine rebounds, 10 assists, two steals, one block. Michael Porter Jr. wins Rookie of the Year, as he always does. Mason Plumlee, sixth man of the year. DeAndre Jordan, defensive player. Deontay Murray, most improved, and Eric Spolstra, coach of the 60. And who the hell is he coaching? Why? Like, who do the Cavs sign now? Last time I did this, they signed JaVale McGee, and it made them way overpowered, but I have JaVale. What? Like, how? Whatever. Uh, we were not first in the Western Conference. Again, it's the Warriors, but I think we can hopefully beat them. Uh, player stats in the year, Lonzo Ball led us in scoring with 25.5 points, four or 6.5 rebounds, 5 assists with 2 steals. Then it was D'Angelo Russell, who is somehow a 90 overall at this point. I don't get it. Uh, and then Jordan Clarkson and Zubox, and then Ingram. Uh, rebounds per game went to Randall, and then Zubok, and then assists per game went to Russell, and then Lonzo Ball. So... Let's take on the Trailblazers in the first round. I bet we can beat them. Hopefully we can beat them because I'd look like an idiot. Okay, we come back from after being down 3-1. Tra Trailblazers blew a 3-1 lead. Now taking on the three-seeded Utah Jazz. Why do we always lose the first game? Okay. Let's just get swept by the fucking Jazz. All right, let's go ahead and simulate the rest of the playoffs. This That was painful, but the Warriors go on to win a championship. So we win a championship in the first year with Lonzo Ball as an overpowered rookie, but we guess we can't as a sophomore. So... Hopefully you guys did enjoy. If you guys did, make sure to like down below. If you guys are new, make sure to subscribe to the channel. I think I'm going to be doing one of these with Markel Fultz, Josh Jackson, Jason Tatum, maybe even Dennis Smith, and maybe Malik Monk. So let me know if you guys want to see those down in the comment section, and I'll see you guys all in the next video.